rest in peace to Chadwick Boseman. For those of you who may not know, Chadwick Boseman was an actor known most for his incredible role in Marvel's Black Panther. Died at age 43 after a four-year fight against colon cancer. The remarkable thing, aside from his illustrious career, is that nobody knew he was sick. I mean, not nobody. I'm sure, like, close friends and family may have known, but nothing leaked out. The public didn't know. He was literally getting chemotherapy and having surgeries and fighting this thing over four years, a span of four years. And just to put in perspective, for folks and even for my, for myself, whenever I think about bitching about, you know, things in my life and and hardships, during those four years, that four-year fight for his life, he kept working. He kept grinding. He made the following six movies during that four-year span. Captain America Civil War, Marshall, which I haven't seen. I want to see it. It's the uh, story of Thurgood Marshall, the first African-American to become and serve a Supreme, as a Supreme Court justice. Avengers Infinity War, Black Panther, which was just a moment, a moment in time and history and culture. Like that movie was like, not just the movie, it was a moment. As well as 21 Bridges, which I have not seen, and The Five Bloods, which I know is on Netflix, but I have not seen as well. And there's been just this outpouring of just like love and reverence for him from all his colleagues, all his fans. It's like nobody had like not one negative bad thing to say about the guy. And I've seen like different clips and interviews with him. And you get a sense of like his grace. You know, there's a a clip that I saw of him speaking about two kids that died of cancer. Because he used to frequent like children's cancer wards and like visit the kids and try to like lift their spirits. And he was speaking about two kids that died that really wanted to get to see the Black Panther movie. And then, like, he broke down as he was saying it. And I wonder how much of that is not only the sense of responsibility he must have felt to those kids and to his fans, but also how much had to do with his own mortality and the shit that he was going through. It's a sad loss, man. Aside from the movies I mentioned, he, he always seemed to take on, like, powerful roles. Like in the movie 42, which is the story of Jackie Robinson, which is the baseball player that broke the color barrier in Major League Baseball. And the story of James Brown, Get On Up. It's a deep, sad loss. And again, just want to say rest in peace to Chadwick Boseman.